always alerting, always tracking. This is Next Weather. Hey, another world, no question about it. 82 right now, and uh, we sat at 85 was the high today. Not a record, but uh, well, close enough for us here. For most of us, temperatures have been in the mid and upper 80s. And that's the way we're going to do it uh, the next uh, few days. So far, February 2023, second warmest on record. We have a few days to go, but it should at least top out in the top three there. And we've never hit 90 degrees on any day in the month of February. I think next Tuesday, which is the last uh, day in February, we're going to come very close. I'm forecasting 89, so if we hit 90, that would be uh, something for the uh, record books there. You see the low 80s now, a cooling a breeze coming in out of the southeast, and those puffy cumulus clouds sometimes will drop a couple of, well, drops, literally, that's about it. It's one of those deals where the sun is out, and you feel the drop, and you think it's raining, and then it's moved on. That's how dry the atmosphere is with the sinking air that we've been talking about. Area of high pressure, it's a broken record because it's a, a pattern that is just an atmospheric traffic jam, if you will, and it's not going to budge. And the only uh, change we have in the eastern seaboard Eventually, we're going to get a big change. So a trough's going to develop. That's when the jet stream dives down. That's when you can make storms across the mid-Atlantic and northeast. For us, that will mean a cold front will get very close. It doesn't look like it's going to sweep through and bring us really cool temperatures, but if it gets close enough and it gets hung up, that will be enough at least uh, to bring us uh, some moisture here and more cloud cover. And I think we'll put a lid on temperatures that uh, are way out of hand at this point here. We'll track this for you the next uh, three days. Temps in the 70s uh, for the most part overnight will be some 60s across inland areas. And then during the afternoons, we're going to climb back uh, with temps in the low to mid 80s. That's the way it's going to stay until we get into early next week and out ahead of uh, with uh, southwesterly wind. That's going to get us back into, uh, well, uh, record territory here as temperatures climb back into the mid 80s uh, for uh, tomorrow. Uh, we are going to be out across the DCC challenge here. It is going to be a warm up for runners, uh, cyclists and walkers as well. Be a nice day out there and then Sunday will feature more of the same with temperatures in the mid 80s and the extended forecast will take you through next week with highs on Tuesday approaching 90 degrees.